Hey everyone, welcome back to another The More Is Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing GameCube. And we are on Sunday, I believe. Sunday the 18th of July. We have some mail already. We've got quite a busy day today, I believe. We need to, of course, make some bells. But more importantly, it is about finding Joan again so we can buy the next batch of turnips. Seems we made a loss last week. But we are also going to visit the Abel Sisters and try to design a, a shirt because a lot of our villagers are wearing the default design so we want to give them something nice to wear so we'll just check out our mail first quickly uh, as always we got from hra your current layout earns 5794 points if we may say so your house is quite spacious spacious really <laughs> it's up to you to whether you expand it or not july 18th 2021 the happy room academy well i don't think it's that spacious to be honest we have got a lot of clutter in here <laughs> I don't know who came to give us our school, but they clearly didn't look inside. Okay, so we also have, what is this? Oh, a letter from Tom Nook. Uh, shipment update, a special notice for our most special customers from today only. We have a selection of items you won't find anywhere else. Nook and go. Ooh, interesting. So th that means they must have items that we wouldn't be able to win from villagers or find in treasure hunts. That's really exciting. And of course, we've got our fossils, but we'll leave those till later. We'll go and say hi to some villagers. Um, oh, we better check the notice board for anything else. Ah, I have a great present for anyone who finds it. It's a pitfall somewhere in one of the one acres. We actually found that yesterday. We haven't used it yet. We're waiting for one of the villagers to be a little bit too angry with us. And then we might use it on them if we're feeling mean. But I don't think we will because we love our villagers. Pearl, good morning. Okay, okay, I hear you, kitten. And I ask that you please lower your voice a few decibels. I didn't sleep well last night. I'm sorry, Pearl. Uh, and I've got a splitting headache like you wouldn't believe oh the horror of, of it all lack of sleep is uh, the arch enemy of beautiful skin you know kitten enough idle chit chat did you need something from me uh do you want to give us some work oh my just had something for you but i'm afraid it's been taken care of maybe next time okay we're gonna have to try and rely on making money from other things selling fruit catching bugs and the seashells and things like that because we don't seem to be getting hello who are you huck's house huck pleased to meet you why are you living right over the bridge <laughs> oh good morning do we know each other hopper because if we do i'm in a daze we don't cool good to know i'm the old noggin is working okay my name's huck how about yourself Oh, really? So you're Maury, huh? That's a cool name, Hopper, if I do say so, and I do. So listen, you seem all right. Feel free to drop by my place anytime you feel like. Hang in. Okay, let's check it out. What kind of house does a frog have? Wow, classic. Very nice. Oh, it's weird because you can't walk close to the piano. Oh, we can play the instruments. Love it. Lots is obviously used to having guests around. Two big tables. Maybe he held some dinner parties. How are you enjoying Moriland? Morning, Hopper. Yeah, so what did you need from me, Hopper? Um, do you have any work since you've just moved in? Actually, I haven't seen my glasses case in ages, it seems like. Well, it can only be less than a day, surely. <laughs> I hardly remember what it looks like. I'm thinking that I lent it to Q, but I'm not entirely sure, Hopper. I'm kind of a space cadet. Anyway, I need a little help. Do you think you could look into it for me? Consider it done, Huck. We shall go get it right now. And then we'll go and check out these exclusive items from Nook and Go that apparently you can't get. Morning, Savannah, from anywhere else. Uh, Cube. Oh, there's the ball. Remember, it is near Cube's house and hopefully no one will kick it over the cliff. Cube, good morning. How are you feeling? See, he's wearing the default shirt. We need to sort this out today. Hey, good morning. You remember my name by now, right, dude? Remember my name? Yep, I'm Cube. Listen, this is embarrassing, but I was freaking out. I often forget my own name. Yeah, so what did you need me for, dude? Oh. Okay, <laughs> I'm picking up. Oh, I'm stoked you're here. You're looking for that glasses case, aren't you? The funny thing is, oh, here we go. I lent it to Tybot, so I don't actually have, oh, I don't have it. Actually, that's not funny, I guess. But since you're already trying to track it down, you can just go get it from Tybot, right? I guess. Get rid of this weed. 
Oh, we need to check the progress of our money tree as well. See if it spawns any money. Kaibot, are you here? There you are, hiding behind a tree. Morning! It feels so invigorating to rise with the birds, doesn't it, Mori? You know what they say, the early bird gets the worm. Did I say that last time I saw you? Uh, no. Anywho, you probably want something, don't you? So what is it? I'm picking up. This is Huck's glasses case, which I was borrowing for a while. For a little too long, I guess. I knew you had I had to return it soon, but I just kept forgetting to do it. Man, I'm a scatterbrained. I would really it would really help me out big time if you could return it for me. You're the best. No problem, Tyvolt. Um, good luck on catching those worms, especially since you live next to a chicken that probably does catch worms. <laughs> Let's get out of here. So, we need to go back to Huck. All the way past our house. I can't believe he he moved right next door to the, to the bridge. Right over the bridge. At least he's not blocking it, I suppose. I got your glasses case. Morning, Hopper. So, what do you need, Hopper? Uh, a delivery, your glasses case that you haven't seen all day. Well, would you look at that? My glasses case. You already got it. Good work, Hopper. Maybe I should have asked you to go get it for me sooner, Hopper. Is 465 bells enough? Uh, yeah. But we do kind of like getting furniture. You've, you've got the right attitude, Maury. I'm so glad I can depend on you, Hopper. No problem. Okay, our nook and go is open on a Sunday. Let's go check out these exclusive items. Oh, a frog shirt. Welcome, do come in, have a look around. Okay, we need to buy this. We need to buy the, oh no, we haven't got many bells. It's a frog shirt, the height of fashion. Or so claims Fauna magazine. Would you like to try it on? No thanks. I suppose you know your size best. No matter, it's only 340 bells. Quite a bargain, hmm, so would you like it? Uh, definitely, we're gonna send this to Huck as a welcome to Moriland present. It's perfect. Uh, 340 bells, thanks much. Please take this raffle ticket as extra, no charge. With five of those, you get one chance in the monthly raffle draw. Exciting, yes? We are nearing the monthly draw as well. Oh, I love that checkboard um, umbrella here. That's really cool. And also, we need to buy a new shovel because apparently we can bury the shovel in the glow spot and get a golden shovel. So we're going to do that. And also, oh, wow. That's a modern table. The price is 1,800 bells. Ooh, we need to buy it, but we don't have the funds and we haven't got any savings. Um, I'm guessing that's the exclusive item that we won't get anywhere else. So we definitely need that. Have we got any paper? Yes, we've got some paper. So let's go and write a letter to Huck to welcome him to Moriland. And hopefully he'll wear our froggy shirt. Um, so let's see. We need to get rid of... Oh, we want to keep that letter because that's kind of a cool letter. Get rid of the HRA. We'll get another one tomorrow. Okay, so we're going to write a letter to Huck. To Huck, welcome to town. Have this frog shirt as a welcome present from Maury. And then we're going to give him, because we're so generous, the frog shirt. Let's go post it. And we can also walk past the dump and make sure if there's any items in there that we can we can use. Okay, so the dump's just through here. Uh, oh, some clothing items. What have we got? A yellow bolero. Let's check it out. Uh, not really my thing. I think we'll stick with the 8-ball shirt for now. It's pretty cool. Although we are going to make a design soon, so maybe we could uh, also wear our own design. We're just going to pick all these papers up. Uh, that way we can catalogue them. Uh, drop. Oh, actually, we can drop them all. Oh, get rid of the paper. Oh, no. <laughs> I picked another one up. Uh, drop. There we go. Oh. Another weed, a spider, another weed hiding by the tree. Right, let's send off this letter to Huck and then we can continue with our chores. How can I help? Someone's already mailed a letter. 
I hope it's for us. Um, here we go. We've got a letter for Huck. Please deliver it promptly because it is a welcome present. Ah, I see. Yes. Would you like to mail more letters? Uh, never mind. Thank you. We need right. We need to make money. Wait. Should we make money first, or should we go to Able Sisters and do a design first? We should probably make some money first, just in case we have to pay to make the design, which I'm pretty sure we do. Pippi, how are you this lovely morning? Wait, well, hey, good morning. Aren't we just brimming with energy, little hair? I'm not quite up to the full peppiness myself. To tell you the truth, I just woke up. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> That's okay, you're allowed to, it's Sunday. I guess this morning is my loss, little hair. So, what's going on? Uh, need any help? I'm so glad you're here. I have the perfect job for you, little hair. You know Woolio, don't you? Uh, yeah. Well, I want you to go and ask that moocher for my organizer back. If you have to happen to be going near Woolio's house, could you pick it up for me, little hair? Uh, definitely. Especially since he's en route to the Able Sisters. So we're going to go right past Woolio. Caught any worms yet? <laughs> right, Woolio's house. He should be living right down here somewhere. Oh, we missed the we missed the ramp. Willio, are you awake? Oh no, he's not in right now. We'll have to try and keep an eye open for him on the way around. Okay, so we should probably catch some fish so we can make some a bit of money so we can make a design and save our villagers from wearing the default ugly default design we need a new one i don't know what we're gonna make oh wait a minute didn't we already plant a tree here oh we will have to come back when we've got another spade so we can we can try and get a a, a golden spade right where are the fish okay here we go i think we're not gonna mo uh, monitor the museum too much or worry about what we oh a sea bass or worry too much about what we've donated. Unless it's pretty obvious. We know for sure sea bass hasn't, uh, has already been donated. So we can sell those. But we just need to concentrate on making some money at the moment. Oh, that that was a quick fish. Ooh, a cicada. We could branch out to catching some bugs as well. I caught a large brown cicada. So we've, we've, I'm pretty sure we've donated that as well. Um... Right, we need some more fish. We can catch four more fish to try and sell. Where are the fish? I feel like we're not going to get anything other than sea bass at this point. Oh, we just about got it. Oh, a red snapper. I'll definitely take that. I caught a red snapper. That was a snap. I really have to stop saying things like this. Okay, oh, another cicada. I don't know how much cicadas are worth, but we'll grab it anyway since it's right there. So, assuming we don't scare it away. Oh, we got it, just. Oh, a robust cicada. I can't remember if we've uh, caught one of those. Okay, so how many... We... Oops. Two more fish, and then we can... Oh, because, all... of course, we need to buy that table as well. And then we'll come back to Able Sisters and design a shirt. Oh no, I scared the fish away. Any fish. Oh, here's one. Come on. Ooh, they do lots of little bites, these ones. Yes, another red snapper. They're like 2,000 bells. And also, we're only something like 40,000 bells away from paying off our loan. So, or our debt. So we definitely need to... I don't know. Find the money rock. Oh, scared another uh, bug away. And and make as much money as possible. We should also shake some trees as well. Um, see if we can find any extra money that we can. But I, I feel like the bugs and the fish will do well for us today. Oh, there's a pond over here, isn't there? Any fish in the pond? Concentrate. Oh, nearly missed it. Oh, a frog. I caught a frog. I think I should kiss. Uh, no, let's not kiss the frogs. But we should probably donate the frog because we know for sure we haven't donated that. Um, so we'll quickly donate the frog. It, it's the thing about this game is you constantly get sidetracked. Oh, hmm. 
What time is it? I'm so very sleepy. Oh dear me, a thousand pardons. So terribly sorry. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a knight. Um, ow. Yes, well, by the by, might there be something which I can assist? Yes, donate this frog. Otherwise, we're going to sell it. <laughs> Here we go. Take the frog. Oh, indeed. A frog, I believe. Gree, gree, gree. That's my best Sonoran green toad impression. What? We do keep frogs and toads here. Well then, let's get our amphibious friends settled. All the damp comforts home. Guaranteed. You have our deepest, most profound gratitude. Might there be anything else you wish to donate? Not at this time, Blathers. That's it for now. We're on a money-making mission. Or a bell-making mission, should I say. Um, we are going to catch, we have, oh, a dragonfly. We have space to catch one more bug. Oh, we missed it. Oh, we missed it again. There we go. We got it. I caught a Dana dragonfly. Dana, I'm good. Okay, Mr. Nook, give us lots of bells, especially for these red snappers. Oh, of course, the camp is still here as well. So we could play some mini games. Hello, Snooty. Haven't got time to stop just yet, but we will come back. Okay, let's sell these things. Welcome, do come in, have a look around. Okay, quick, I need to sell something. Yes, yes, what can I do for you? Uh, I'd like to sell. Very well then, show me what you've got. Uh, we're gonna get rid of this yellow shirt. This, 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 and all the bugs and fish. And hopefully, we should get something like 5,000 bells. Come to 7,127 bells. Yes, we'll definitely sell. And before we forget, Oh, I've still got a shell in there, actually. But we, we could deal with that later. We are going to buy this awesome table. That's a modern table. The price is 1,800 bells. We definitely want that. The modern set is really, really awesome. Um, oh, we've got another a raffle ticket for the exclusive item as well. So uh, anything else? Oh, we need to buy a, another shovel. That's a shovel. Price is fifth, uh, 500 bells. It's a steal at that price. We'll definitely take that. Yep, and then just press the A button. Yep, we know how to use the shovel. But thank you, Tom Nook. Very polite in always telling us how to use our tools. Right, we're just going to sell this as well before we forget. Uh, 150 bells for a shell that we just picked up. That is a bargain. Excuse me. Okay, let's go. And we are going to, before we do anything else, before we play any camper games or do any, or try and do any more work for villagers, we are going to design our Able Sisters shirt. That's, we're not even going to talk to Copper, we're going straight past him. Even though we probably know what he's going to say because he hinted yesterday that Katrina, uh, not Katrina, Gracie is, oh Joan, hello. <laughs> he hinted that Gracie is coming again tomorrow, so that's something good to look forward to. And hopefully we try harder and get a, a new fashion item. Well, hello there, kiddo. It's Sunday morning already. This week has gone so quick. I've been selling my turnips for, oh, about 60 years. So, Joan, that name you can trust. So, do you need an explanation how turnip trading works? I already know. Oh, really? That's good. Well, uh, when you get to be my age, it can be pretty exhausting having to explain so much. Today's asking price. Whoa! Today's asking price is 123 bells per turnip. Are you going to buy some? That is a good question. We are going to buy. That is very high. I'm not sure they go much higher than that, to be honest. But we will buy 10. Just 10 turnips. I feel that's a safe bet. One, two, three, zero bells. Here you go, kiddo. Thank you. So that could be, it wouldn't be so bad if we lost that, but it could be a nice profit if we get like 140, 150 for a turnip. Much obliged. How about it, kiddo? Do you want more? Uh, no, thanks. If we bump into you later, we might buy more if we've got some more money, but I think 10 is safe for now. You've made an old woman very happy. See you next Sunday. Bye, Joan. I can't believe we found you so quickly. It was a long journey last week. We'll come back and do the golden spot. We'll go straight to the Able Sisters. We must rescue these animals from that default design. 
Okay, hi there, come on in. Welcome to Able Sisters, where you are the famous fashion designer. Oh, I'm so sorry. I know it seems like I never have time for you. I'm just so busy. Please forgive me. That's absolutely fine, Sable. No worries. Okay, this is the shirt they're all wearing. I have all of these. They picked this one. The default shirt. Okay, we need to change it. Oh, yes. What do you need? Uh, oh, lots of things we can do here. Um, we need to design a pattern. Oh, you want to create your own design? Great, it'll cost, oh, 350 bells for materials. Of course, that's okay, right? Um, yeah, that's cheaper. I thought it was gonna be like 500. Oh, and you can only keep eight designs. Eight designs. See the upgrades we've come from? Only eight designs in the original. Oh, and you can only keep eight designs, so you'll have to give up one of the patterns you have now. Is that okay? That's fine. We've got a few blank designs. Um, great, you can start right after you choose where you want to keep your new design. Um, so, I think th these are cool because these are the default ones, so we'll keep these for now. We'll design one here in a blank one, and then we will, uh, we will replace the one on the shop floor, and hopefully the, new vi the villagers start wearing the new design. So, we'll start with the blank. Now, what do we want to design? Um... I should have thought this earlier. I think we want it to be quite summery. So how do we go? Here we go. We could, I think summery. Start with a yellow. Oh, we can make some. Oh, let's make a polka dot. Yes, let's make a. I don't know. I'm not a very good designer. Let's make a polka dot. Oh, whoa. That's pretty cool. That's kind of weird. But I don't know if, if we like that. Um. How do we undo? Um, no, that, it makes it look like a poison frog or something. I think what we're going to do is some horizontal lines. So we're going to stick with this summer theme. So that's pretty cool, actually. I don't know if I like that color. Oh, that's more interesting. But that's probably a bit too much, actually. Uh, let's just swap the color. Oh, no. It's so hard to control these. We accidentally set it to a circle. Right, let's try again. There we go. That's a bit more subtle. I quite like that. Uh, I think maybe we could... Oh, really tempted to put like a Triforce in there or something. Um, but maybe we could make like a little... Just a little kind of pocket. <laughs> That's kind of cute. Um, can we just make a little kind of pocket? There we go. I think I feel like it needs a border. There, perfect. It's like a, it's like a wetsuit thing. <laughs> I don't know if I like the colours still. It's, it seems a bit bold. There we go, that looks more like it. Is this okay? Yes. So a nice summery basic shirt because I'm not a very good designer with a tiny little pocket. Wow, wow, cool, that's a great design. What would you like to call it? We are gonna call it Summer Shirt. <laughs> or just call it Summer actually. I don't know how long, we, how many characters we've got. We'll just call it Summer. Maybe we could make one every season. Uh, that comes with 350 bells. It was worth it, huh? Is there anything else I can do for you? Uh, not right now, but we are also going to come back here and scan a bunch of e-reader cards in the next week or so and get some proper designs. So can we display this summary outfit? See what it looks like? Uh, yes, yeah, sure thing. I'd like to call that design the cl clothing pattern. Can I help you with it? I want to display mine. That means I have to get rid of the pattern we have on the display now. But you're fine with that, right? Sure, it's not my pattern. Okay, so which design would you like to display? Our uh, awesome summery wetsuit style pocket t-shirt, please. That's pretty cool. I'm impressed. It doesn't look as bad as I thought. Wow, that's so nice. And who knows? Maybe it will be the new must-have style next season. I hope it's this season. That's pretty cool. I like the pocket. We should wear it. Oh, how do we wear it? Um... Or maybe we can't do it inside. Or maybe I have to do it from here. I don't know. Thanks again. You come back now. Oh, we will. 
we're going to do one for each season across the back of the shop there. So, what have we got? How do we get that design and wear it? Oh, use, of course. Use on clothes. Wow. And we also have a pocket on our hat. <laughs> okay, let's go and see Cube to see if his design has changed. Or he might have to go in the shop and kind of change it. Um, I don't know if it changes automatically. It would be really cool if it did. I'd love to see... Oh, there's a weed. Would love to see Cube in a summery shirt. Okay, Cube, where are you? Please be at home. Oh, he's got his original shirt back on. Hey, it's you again. What's up, dude? Um, what's up? Need any help? Actually, I haven't seen my camera in ages, it seems like. I hardly remember what it looks like. I'm thinking that I lent it to Snooty, but I'm not entirely sure, dude. I'm kind of a space cadet. Anyway, I need a little help. Do you think you could look into it for me? Sure. So it looks like when we change the design an animal is wearing, they get their default shirt back. And by the way, that is a cool shirt. But it would have been cool to see you in the summer wear as well. Okay, so Snooty has a camera. Lots of villagers moving in on this side of the map now. Three right next to each other. We could do with one down here somewhere. How many have we got now? Uh, we've still got a few that can move in. Hello, Snooty. Huh? What? Uh, uh, it's Maury. Hello, Sniff. Sorry, I'm a touch sleepy. Why is everyone so sleepy in the morning? Uh, you sure are full of beans for this early in the morning. So full of beans, it ticks me off. Oh, wow. But let's get right to the point. What can I do for you, Sniff? I'm picking up. Here's Cube's camera. Take good care of it now. Wow, she cannot wait to get rid of me, can she? I knew I should have returned it sooner. I do hope you'll make a, up a good cover story for me. You will, won't you? That's what I need from you in its entirety. It's in your hands now. Okay, it's in our hands. We should probably check a few... Money rocks as well. Come on, money rocks. Nope. Nope, it was too good to be true. It would have been too easy. This is my favourite rock, because you can just hopefully jam yourself in between the cliff. No. <laughs> okay, we haven't seen Buzz yet. He's normally the grumpiest of grumpy. But on the way, we might see him. Oh, hello, Buzz. Is it really necessary to make such a racket this early? Why are you so bright and bouncy, Maury? Oh, okay, fine. Good morning. There, I said it. All nice. Is that better? Happy now? What are you? The darn makes sure morning is good, police captain? Get a life. So then, what? <laughs> Buzz is so brutal. So what? So then, captain, what are you here for? Entertain me, Buzz. What are you doing today, other than being grumpy? Have you heard the legend of the old man who wanders from town to town, spewing both rage and helpful advice? That's me, Captain. That's my strange fate. The road is my life, Captain. I have a suitcase full of memories, a belly full of bile, and the need to travel and help folks. Is he about to tell me he wants to leave? Oh boy, yes sir, I haven't been here long, Captain. But before you know it, I'll have lost my patience and moved to another town. Story of my life. But like everyone else in every town I've ever been to, I'm sure you'll be happy to see me go, Captain. Actually, I won't. I really, li I really like you. Don't be so moody. Okay, chase me down. I see. Okay, let's bury this shovel and hope it grows. Check it out. I've got a thousand bells. So if we bury a shovel, it somehow turns into a plant. Oh, it looks golden already, doesn't it? And hopefully we can grow a golden tree with a golden, uh, golden shovel on it. Okay, so of course we need to take Cube's camera back, put our turnips to safety, and also we need to find some fossils. Okay, Cube, we are coming right up to your house, a couple of acres away, and hopefully he will give us an awesome reward that we haven't got yet. Hey, it's you again. What's up, dude? Yeah, so what did you need me for, dude? I got a delivery, and it's your camera! My camera, you brought it back! I couldn't sleep soundly without it. 
Thanks to you, I'll get a good night's sleep every night, dude. Ah, oh, well done. Oh, I have this stationery. I guess it's just have to do. Oh, I hope you don't mind. No, no, no. That's fine. Well done, Cube. Thank you very much. Do you want a ball? Okay, so we need to find some fossils as well and also check out what fossils we've got. Um, so... These are the fossils we got today. We got a Tricera skull, a Amber, which we've already got, so we can sell the Amber, and an Ammonite. Oh, I thought it would be a dinosaur egg. We've gotten a dinosaur egg every time. Okay, we're digging up fossils today to send today instead of the day before like we have been doing, because my theory is that we can get some rarer fossils if we dig them up on the day we... I missed. On the day we send them. Oh, a gyroid! Check it out. I dug up a howloid. Awesome. Always down to uh, dig up a gyroid. So we need two more fossils. Can't see any. There is bound to be one near the shop, I think. They do like to spawn up this side. There we go. I knew there would be one here. Two fossils. Check it out. I dug up a fossil. So we just need one more. Oh, of course, Snooty was supposed to be happier with us because we planted flowers near her house. But she's still mad at us for some reason. Right. We need one more fossil. Where will this fossil likely be hiding? <laughs> Along the beach somewhere? Oh, we should check the money rock as we're going as well. Oh no! I totally missed the rock. Okay, here we go. Line up a bit better. No, nope, it's not even the one. I really like that. I'm pretty sure the other one didn't turn gold. Okay, it could be... Oh, Willio, there you are! Morning Bazaar, it feels so invigorating to rise with the birds, doesn't it, Maury? You know what they say, the early bird gets the worm. Did I say that last time I saw you? No, but you've been hanging around with Tybalt too much because he said that. Hey, so what can I do for you? I'm picking up. Hey, don't get me wrong, I want to give it to you, but seriously, I just can't. It's not me, it's you. You can't carry anything. Oh. Oh no. That's fine. Let's get rid of, let's transfer some fossils over. And we can write some... Luckily, we got some paper off someone. I can't remember. And we'll quickly write some letters to the museum. And then we can transfer our fossils to the letters. No, not that one. <laughs> there we go. And now we should be able to take the item back. I can't remember who we're taking it to, but hopefully Woolio will remind us. I'm picking up. This is Pippi's organizer, of course. I was borrowing it for a while, for a little too long, I guess. I knew I had to return it soon, but I just kept forgetting to do it. It would be really help big time if you could return it for me. You're the best. Bizarre, the best. Thank you, Julio. That's right. That's it. That's the errand. Don't let me down. You are too cool for school. <laughs> okay, let's go and check out. Oh, a pond fish. Savannah, good morning. Noisy cicada. This has got to be the rock. Hopefully. No! Aha! Our last fossil! No! It's another gyroid, but that's good. A stromboid. Love the gyroids. If only we had more places to store them. Oh! A present! Oh no! I don't have a... We don't have a slingshot! Oh my goodness! I... How do you get a slingshot? Oh, that was uh, a, very much a surprise. I totally forgot there was balloons in the GameCube version. Oh, now we need to keep an eye out for a slingshot. Okay, so... No, that's Pearl. Where's Pippi? Good morning again, little hare. So, what's going on, little hare? 
I've got a delivery, finally. I, I totally forgot about it until we saw Willio. I've seen this before. Isn't this my organizer, little hare? I just knew in my heart that I'd get it back eventually, but I never thought it'd be back so soon. I've got just the ticket, stationary little hare. It's perfect gift for all occasions. When you say you're going to do something, you just go right out and do it. I'm glad to know that little hare. No problem. Okay, so... We need to find one more. We don't want any more stationery. We're going to ditch this stationery. There's too much stationery in this town. In fact, we're going to drop all of them. There we go. Look at that. Too much stationery. Where's the furniture? <laughs> okay, so we've got two gyroids which we could put in our house. Actually, we can store gyroids in our gyroids. Welcome home, Maury. May I be of an assistance? Yes, we want to store an item. We can store four items inside our gyroid. So I think just for now, we're going to... Can we do two? No, we can do, only do one at a time. There we go. So we're going to just display it. Because you can set up a little shop kind of thing. So you can sell things to people who visit your town. Um... But we, or you could give it away for free if you want, but we're just going to display it. So these are display only. So it's just a place to keep our spare gyroids, make some space in our pockets until we've got more space in our house. Right, we need to go sell these fossils. And of course we need to donate one of the fossils, but we need to sell two fossils. Hello, welcome, do come in, have a look around. Okay, we just want to sell, we don't want to look around. I'd like to sell. Very well then, show me what you've got. We've got a broken axe, nearly. Uh, eight ball shirt, which we might keep actually. Oh, modern table, uh, I forgot what we are going to sell. Yes, just these two. I don't think we need an umbrella. I think we're going to get rid of our umbrella. We can always come and buy a new one, so we'll sell that as well. If I add up, that comes to 2,395 bells. Tell me, is there anything else you wish to sell? Not at the moment. But we do need to find... Oh, we may as well check the wallpapers, actually. Here, oh, a modern screen. Very nice. Isn't that the one we've got? Let me see. Yeah, we've already got that one. Uh, no, thank you. You can let it go cheap because clearly it's quite common. <laughs> No, you're sure? Well, no matter. Feel free to keep browsing. Let's check out the carpet. Oh, the kitchen flooring. No, we don't want that either. We just like the cool carpets. Okay, so we... Oh, we need to speak to Copper. We need to check the wishing well. We need to catch some more fish if we've got time. And we need to donate this fossil and find another fossil. There's always things to do. And we haven't played with our camper yet. Okay, let's play a couple of games with the camper. See if we can earn any camping items. We're going to drop... I don't think they take turnips. We're going to drop these. Actually, we can risk the 8-ball shirt. There we go. We can drop these items. We don't want them taking our items. Curly, you're still here. Welcome to the tent of camper extraordinaire. Curly, when it comes to camping, I rule. So, what's it looking like out there this morning? Bright? Warm? Should I fish or hike or what? Well, I'll figure it out. If you think I'm wasting a single second of this camera trick, you're crazy. Let's play some games. Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. I've heard there's lots of wildlife in this area. Do you know where the best viewing area is? What do you mean, just take a look around? Curly, can we play some games? Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. I want to climb the summit of Mount Moriland, but I can't find the trailhead. Do you know where it is? You don't? Oh, I guess I'll just have to keep looking. Let's play a game. Okay, I guess you don't want to play a game. Let's go out. And then back in again. And hopefully this will reset and he'll want to play a game. Curly, let's play. Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. I've heard there's lots of... No... Obviously, he doesn't want to play. Okay, let's go and donate this fossil before we get too sidetracked. Um, Copper, how are you today? Any goings-on that we should know about? Are you probably just going to tell us about Gracie? 
Good day to you. Well, aren't we a busy little bee buzzing to and fro? Tell me, how could Officer Copper be of assistance? Um, any goings on? You ask about goings on? Well, on July 19th, the police station will be running our BIP campaign, Bust Illegal Parkers. Maury, I hope you have not been involved in any sort of illegal parking activity whatsoever. Ah, you don't even own an automobile, do you? I must beg your pardon. No problem. It would be cool to have a car, but sadly, we can't even buy our own house yet. <laughs> Wake up, Blathers. I think we have a fossil that you don't have. Oh dear me, a thousand pardons, so terribly sorry. Yes, well, by the by, <laughs> might that be, uh, yes, there's something you can assist me with. You can take this fossil. What no doubt priceless item might you have for us today? A Tricera skull. I don't think we've got any skulls, so it should be new. Oh, oh, I say a Tricera skull. The day the remaining pieces of our prehistoric puzzles are found will be a joyous one indeed. Good luck to you. You have our deepest, most profound gratitude. Might there be anything else you wish to donate? No, but we are going to check out the Tricera skull. Where is it? Oh, wow. Tricera skull donated by Mori. This museum is filling up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven so far. Not bad at all. Still no paintings though. That's always the hardest one. Okay, so. We should probably quickly check the wishing well. Make sure there's nothing weird going on. How are things wishing well? In areas where there are very little green, a feeling to spare still. Go to acre A1 and see what's amiss. How many trees do we need in this town? The wishing well just wants us to continuously plant trees. Okay, let's check out some of the villagers. We haven't really spoken to Woolio, Woolio other than the the one errand that brought us to him. Yo, bizarre. Anywho, you probably want something, don't you? So, what is it, Bazaar? Uh, need anything? Oh, yeah, I got a little job for you. Check this out. I lent an organiser to Tybalt the other day. Nickname, Dandruff. Because Tybalt's all about flaking. <laughs> this is, I'm too... Oh, thing is, I'm too busy to get my property. So, can you go pick it up for me? What do you say? I suppose. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not going to bring up the Dandruff situation. He might be a little embarrassed. Okay, let's go. Tybalt literally lives up the hill, so I think Woolio's just being lazy. Tybalt, where are you? Not around here. We went too far. Oh, you lot all like to hang out, don't you? Tybalt, but I'm here on important business. I need an organizer. Hey, it's now officially 11.29 a.m. Anywho, you probably want something, don't you? So what is it? Uh, I'm picking up. It's not like I forgot about it or anything. Seriously, I've just been real busy, you know, doing my thing. If I go and give this organizer, you will return to Woolio for me, right? Absolutely, that's what we're here for. Thanks for your help. Don't forget. Thank you for your help. Um, straight down to Woolio. I noticed Joan has disappeared as well. We haven't bumped into her anymore. So it's a good job we bought some turnips when we first saw them. Right. Yo, Bizarre, tell me more. What's new? Uh, delivery, I've got your organizer. And hopefully, please give us some furniture. We haven't had any furniture. I'm so stoked you brought this back for me. Thanks, Bizarre. Now for your reward. How about some stationery? This is officially... The Day of Stationery. The 18th of July is hereby known as the Day of Stationery. You know, Maury, you do good work regardless of what others say. What do others say? Man, I don't know who you can trust around here. A lot of suspicious chitter chatter. Okay, so there's nothing else down here. We still need one more fossil as well. There must be one around here somewhere. Um, and also, we haven't found the money rock yet, I just remembered. So 
where is this last? There must be. It must be the last star. Oh, there we go. Yay! So we found these on the day. So hopefully they bring us some really rare fossils. Okay, let's go mail these quickly. Oh, get rid of that. This has got to be the one. I don't know if we've got any more rocks. Oh no, we must have some more rocks. Uh, let's see. No rocks up here. Pelly, can you please mail me three more letters? Because we should do this every day because it's a really good money maker. Ah, yes, I see. Would you like to mail more letters? Yes, please. One more, please, Pelly. I know this is very repetitive, so sorry about that, but we've got to mail these letters. I'm actually really liking our outfit that we made. I'm quite pleased. If you have any ideas for outfits, let us know in the comments and we might make them next episode. Rain, sleet, snow or hail will deliver what you mail. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day, Pelly. Pete. Fly safe. Okay, so. What have we got left to do today? We need to go and see if we can place our modern table inside our house. I don't think we're going to... Oh, we've got mail. I wonder if it's from Huck already, if he likes his new shirt. Uh, okay, we're going to have to put the table down. And we're going to get rid of our turnips as well. Keep them safe. And also uh, our July tickets. Do a bit of organising. Can't have messy pockets, can we? And Oh, and that's our eight ball. There we go. Oh no, every time. I do that every time. There we go. Okay, our house is sorted, but we do need... To, we probably will aim to complete the upgrade tomorrow. Because um, I don't think we're good. We've not made enough. We haven't had time. There's just... There's too many things to do. Right, let's check out this mail. Oh no, it's not a present. Someone's not very happy. Oh, from Lee. That's okay. Hey, listen, I think you're nice and all, but don't keep sending me these creepy letters. I mean, the last one made no sense and it really freaked me out. Seriously, talk to the hand. Wow. I thought we were getting along. Okay, these are the letters we want to save. And also, we can save them at the post office. So, I think when we've got a couple more letters we want to save, we're going to go and save them at the post office. Just because these are the kind of letters you can only really get once. Um, definitely things like um, upgrading to Nook and Go and stuff. So, that's a really cool letter to just keep, I think. So, I think... We're going to give one more try to the camper. We're going to buy some furniture that we don't mind losing. To see if we can tempt the camper into basically taking our furniture or giving us some new furniture and playing games. Oh, uh, that's a boxing barricade. 1,000 bells. Wow. I'll buy it. I don't think it's that much of a steal, though. It's quite expensive. Oh, of course, another ticket, even though we just emptied our pockets. <laughs> okay, so here we go. We're going to go and play one game with the camper. We don't need to find Joan. I don't know where the money rock is. I don't think there's a rock over here, is there? No. There must be one we haven't found just yet, so... Also, we're gonna drop... 5,000 bells. Just so the camper doesn't steal them. Right, drop these here. Then the camper can't steal our money because we need that to pay off our loan or buy things. Curly, hey, are you here to go uh, to do some hardcore mountain climbing with me? Sure. 
You're kidding! No one ever wants to go with me. Um, actually, I don't have enough climbing gear for the both of us. Yeah, that's the deal. So, why don't we play a game instead? Yes, let's play a game. This is the best part of interacting with a camper. Okay, great. I need a little entertainment. Now, here's what I'll do. I have some pictures of some fish I caught before. But I also have pictures of fish I uh, caught by professional anglers. I want you to try and figure out which one is which. If you get it right, I'll trade you for the boxing barricade. But if you get it wrong, I get your boxing barricade for free. Oh, one in four chance. We haven't won one yet, so we're going to just try again. Take a look at these photos. Aren't they some beautiful fish? Here's a salmon. This is a bluegill. This is a stringfish. And this beauty is a large char. So, smarty pants, which of these fish did I catch? We're just going to go for the first one. You said large char, right? How did you know? Finally, we won the game! Please let it be a camping item. How did you know I caught the large char? Shoot, now I have to trade you something for your boxing barricade, don't I? <gasps> it's a piece of furniture! I hope you're happy with the backpack. Yes! A camping item. We got the backpack. That is so good. We need to go and check this out. What a way to end the video. We finally, finally got a camping item. They are so hard to get. One in four chance. And that was our fifth... Well, it's not one, one in four chance because we, we lost four times earlier. We got it on the fifth attempt. So technically it's still a one in four chance. But we just had some really bad luck. Okay, we haven't got room, but we're going to put it down anyway, just because it's really awesome. There it is. The camping backpack. That is so cool. The camping stuff is one of my favorite sets. Right, we're going to pick up these tickets. So we can drop them again. We're going to place the backpack there. And then we're going to quickly grab our bells and put them back in the pocket. There we go, so we haven't got enough really to warrant going all the way to the post office just to pay something off. So we'll leave that for tomorrow. And of course, Gracie should be here tomorrow as well with her car. So we should have a chance to clean the car again and try and unlock a clothing item. Gracie has an entire exclusive set available, but it's really hard to unlock. So we'll try super hard. And then we are going to talk to the villagers and mail them some letters because we haven't mailed the villagers in a while. So we're going to do that. And basically, check out Nook's Cranny, or Nook and Go, should I say, now that we've got the upgraded one. Spend some money so we can try and upgrade the next shop. And of course, aim to pay off our debt. We're going to catch so many fish tomorrow that we pay off our debt, hopefully. Assuming we're not too tired from cleaning Gracie's car. But yeah, for now, I think that pretty much wraps up this, this video. We made an awesome summary outfit that doesn't look too bad. It's got a nice little pocket. We did some chores. We got a camping gear. We got exclusive items from Nook and Go. And we did some chores for the villagers. So everyone is happy. And of course, we also met Huck, the frog. And we sent him a Welcome to Moriland shirt. So it'll be interesting to see if he's wearing that tomorrow. But for now, that pretty much wraps up this video, I think. So thank you for watching. And as always, please like and subscribe so you don't miss out on the next video. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!